Hi everyone, today our globe is suffering from several problems, including air pollution, global warming, ozone hole, etc. So, I'm going to talk about hydrogen as a clean source of energy. First of all, hydrogen is a chemical element in the first case of the periodic table, and its atomic number is 1. This is why hydrogen gas is 14 times lighter than the air, and rises up to the top, and it consists of one proton and electron. Hydrogen consists 75% of the mass of the universe and its importance in water molecules are too low. Also, it's indispensable in organic materials and determine if a solution is acid or basic. Also, hydrogen is the main interactive in nuclear reactions of stars. So, the hydrogen gas is not reproduced by some bacteria but with low percentage and it is really produced by many ways like the reaction of some metals with acids like chloridic acid with aluminum. or by water, using this tool called electrolyte, and it's composed of a set of zinc plates. Also, dual hydrogen gas can be produced by the reaction of some metals with water, like sodium, lithium, or potassium, or other metals in the first line of the periodic table, called alkaline metals. For example, the reaction of lithium of our batteries with water. This is why it's dangerous, because if there is a hole in the battery, the lithium can be reacted with, uh, with water vapor in the air, uh, produce a dual hydrogen gas, what causes fire. You see, it's extremely dangerous. Because burning hydrogen produces 5000 degrees Celsius and H2 can automatically burn in hot temperatures more than 500 degrees Celsius or a spark and this reaction with oxygen produces water vapor H2O this is why you can't burn water because it's a product of another combustion process of H2 so we can't burn a material already burned finally we can say hydrogen is the future source of energy because it doesn't pollute the air and doesn't produce any toxic gas just water vapor uh, so using dual hydrogen instead of other fuels uh, to reduce producing greenhouse gases and protect our ozone layer that's important to see our globe green again I hope you enjoyed my video and thank you for watching.